Hi, my name is Rachel Ewens. I'm a mobile strategist and I run the app blog LadyAppApp.com. And today we're going to talk about how to make your mobile internet on your iPhone faster. Now, this is kind of a hard topic because the problem is, is that the amount that we're using mobile bandwidth is growing far faster than the amount that our um, cell providers can give us more bandwidth. So we're kind of stuck in a slow place right now. Um, 4G is just starting to come out, so we're able to use that. But for many of us who are still on 3G, um, we're kind of chugging along on our internet. So I'm going to give you a couple tips that'll help you optimize the experience. But until we get faster broadband and until we're on 4G, we can only make it so much faster. But this is a start. So the first thing we're going to do to make our internet faster is we're going to go to the settings button. We're going to go down to general. And from there, we're going to go to network. And you're going to want to make sure you've enabled 3G. Now this is a pretty basic thing and most people will already have it enabled, but it is a starting point. The next thing we're going to want to do is, if it's at all possible, you want to use Wi-Fi rather than your 3G. Wi-Fi will always be faster. So you can find your Wi-Fi right here. Right now it's not connected. I don't have Wi-Fi here, but there are Wi-Fis open. If you have a place that there is Wi-Fi offered and you can get on the network, that's always going to make your internet faster. Now, like I said, we're kind of limited in the speed. Um, it's not sky's the limit. It's not really like your home internet where you can optimize it. Um, but there are some things we can do. One example is that we can surf mobile websites rather than desktop websites. So a good example of this, we'll go to a retail site right now. We're going to go to forever21.com. So they have a mobile site. It loads pretty quickly. Let's look at that in comparison to their desktop site. Much more slowly to load. And that's because it's going to have bigger images. It's going to be optimized to go through you know, desktop internet speeds. So whenever it's possible, try to surf sites that have a mobile site rather than just a desktop site. Another good option if you're really big into reading blogs or uh, kind of reading internet content is rather than going to those blogs directly to use an RSS reader. Some good ones to use are Google Reader. Um, and that will download a lot less graphics, a lot less styling, so you're just pretty much getting the raw text and the raw images. It's going to make things load a little bit faster. It's not actually optimizing your speed, but it's kind of increasing the perception of it. So you've made a couple tweaks that are going to help optimize your internet speed. This is how to make your internet faster on your iPhone.